here is what's probably going to be the permanent and final fan set up in my room for the rest of the summer until winter, probably. Anyways, you guys may have known I've been switching back and forth between, ha between having this with the long blades up there, this over here, and with this with these blades up here. These are the other blades. These are the original blades that go to it. These are not the original blades, by the way. I've also been switching back and forth and having this on forward or reverse. So, starting up here. So anyways, after experience, I decided this would be the permanent setup, probably, for now. Anyways. Here we've filled up the Medea SCW 18 b 2 clip thread. It's been running in high almost constantly. And then we got the air conditioner running. Is this to help ventilate my room? Keep air circulating between my room and the hallways and yeah. I mean, right now, if we got the doors open, I would open my windows, but that'd be a bit risky because it's forecasted to this. It's forecasted to have. Sorry. We're gonna have fun, we're gonna have thunderstorms later, apparently. Okay. So there's that. Actually, sometimes we don't. I, actually, one of my setups actually was to have this turned off. And to have it just throw it away and not. Basically, is one of my setups involved not having this fan needed because this fan would be in forward and high and it would be pushing air down and out and thus circulate, thus still maintaining circulation. However, I'm gonna explain more, I'm gonna explain why I don't do it anymore now. Over here, we've still got, we've got this fan, we're just staying up here probably. Because this fan with the original long blades, this fan is the long and sky fire series ceiling fan. By the way, you've seen this before if you're a long time subscriber. This fan needs to stay up with its original blades right here, but it's sometimes a little bit too strong, and also it's not, and also yet put strain against this take over here and this is pretty much enough for me actually to be honest. so this fan just stays here with the Dafeng Liang Hao Shuang blades and I use it sometimes when I've got like the windows open and I don't need circulation from this or this but I still need some circulation this is, this is the fan I use I don't have another use for this fan when I'm wiping my phone and my watch. I normally wipe them in this area sometimes, and this fan helps cool me down while I'm in this area wiping the watch, wiping stuff. So yeah, that's that. Hunter Pacific Aurora two. I decided we'll probably permanently stay in reverse. Because it's in such a cramped space that when it's on forward, it's weird because sometimes the air will flow down a lot. Sometimes the air will go outward more. It probably has to do with like temperatures and layers of air. And I think when it's hot and there's more of a layer of warm air up here, this fan likes to not push it downwards easily at the time of seeing anyways. And I and I found a way to actually have it to actually have the fan move air downwards a lot. Which is strange. Which is actually to have it only with only installed with two blades. I don't know why but it has to do with it with it being in such a small space that for some reason two blades actually move more air downwards than all four blades. But my mom didn't like the idea of that, so she didn't like the look of it and whatnot, so 
even though this is my room, she still sees everything inside and whatnot. So it is gonna have gonna be how how it is for now. And the reason why reverse is so ideal in this small space is because when there gets funneled to the walls, it gets pushed directly down. So yeah. And I've also heard that many people also use this strategy when they have a fan installed in a space that's too small for it, they often reverse it. And here, we've got the Washer G 16 inch mini fan, which I use above and better quite a lot, actually. Yeah, I use it pretty much almost every night, unless I got this on. And also, I put a switch to it, and my dad, or my helper, keeps putting my bag in the way of the switch, which makes it it's not, which makes it a lot, which makes it quite a bit harder for me. I put a switch to it because what happened was the original switch to it broke, and yeah. And for a while, I just had had the wires connected using a terminal block, and then I realized that it's. I need a switch because otherwise if there's no switch I'll have to reach here to unplug. So now that there's a switch you can easier and easily just turn it on and off like this. It's a good fan, it's not decent fan actually. It's not too strong. But it's still strong enough to keep the cool. Sharp air conditioner has been here for what seems like for quite a while already. So it is probably on a This is actually probably permanent. Almost definitely. I hate it sometimes when it gets really hot. And yeah. There you guys have it. Thanks for watching and hope you enjoyed. And if you like my videos, feel free to subscribe.